Back cover. Jesus Christ. Cannot be undone. He is resurrected. There is no going back. No defeat. No replacement. He is locked into the timetable of God's eternal purpose. Forever to come. He is set. And sealed. As the eternal king. Once he takes the throne. Man is done. Once he takes the throne. All freedom. Private thought. Personal reflection. Vice. Sin and desire is forever bound beneath his sovereignty. We lose. Every last one. He is the king, that God promised. The Lord, that God swore would come. He is the one, that will possess the kingdom forever. There is not a free soul among man. Not a single liberated conscience. It is all, word and deed and people, sealed in absolute defeat, beneath the resurrected glory of Jesus Christ. Bound absolutely, by the Lordship of Christ's throne. Everything we do, is done against that day. Because that day is already here. Because it is already guaranteed. Because Satan, failed to persuade the Lord Jesus to sin against the will of the highest, and the highest, by righteous recognition of the soul of Jesus Christ, which is free of iniquity, entered into genuine contact with his being, and brought the Lord's soul out of death, and crowned him with the spirit of life eternal, in the glory of God. This is impossible for anything corrupt or tainted with iniquity, because no iniquity may at any time touch the highest, and Christ only, has ever come forth from the highest, and only his glorified soul, together with all washed in his righteous spirit, may at the eternal end, enter into the rest of God, and on that day, they are taken forever to be inside the spirit of the highest, only Christ, may give the soul the rest of God, it is his exclusive right by his exclusive righteousness, by the glory of God, that indwells him fully, exclusively, he is, as he said, I am the door I am the life I am the resurrection and no man cometh to the Father, but by me.